The Bulls didn't have DeMar DeRozan last night. And your boy Lonzo Ball messed around and got a 20-point, 10-rebound, double-double. You don't find that suspicious. What? You don't find that suspicious. What are you saying? You don't find that suspicious. How are you guys doing today? And welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time listening to my, my video, please hit the like button and click subscribe. It will help the YouTube algorithm and also will help with the development of more and future content as we move forward. Now, I want to discuss our guy Lonzo Ball. Lonzo Ball, can he be a consistent 20 points per game score? Right now, the Chicago Bulls are very short-handed. Alex Caruso is out. Uh, they have they have Devonte Green, they have Kobe White, and they also have Demar Derozan and COVID safety protocol. So the question today is: Can Lonzo Ball be that third option, that consistent third option, even when Demar Derozan comes back? Can Lonzo Ball be that consistent fourth option and potentially average over 20 points per game, even 20 points a game for his whole entire season? Let's take a look. I mean, guys, let's face it, right? There are games in which Lonzo Ball looks like he's the greatest shooter of all time. And then there are games in which Lonzo Ball looks like he's never picked up a basketball a day in his life. I hear that boy is good. Good and terrible. You know, Zoe was currently averaging only 12 points per game, which is down two points from last season. When you think about it, that sounds about right, right? You know, Lonzo is playing with Zach Levine. You know, he's playing with DeMar DeRozan. He's playing with Nikola Vucevic. So honestly, Zoe is technically the fourth option, right? Let's be kidding. Let's not be kidding ourselves, right? But you got to understand, the Bulls right now need Zoe to step up. You know, they've lost Alex Caruso because of injury. You know, they have Devontae Green out. They have Kobe White out. And just recently, they have DeMar DeRozan out for safety protocol. So the Bulls need Lonzo to be that consistent 20-point score per game. And last night was indicative of what Lonzo Ball can potentially do when he decides to be more than just a three-point shooter. Let's take a look at Lonzo Ball's last 10-game stretch. Now, obviously, last night, Zoe averaged 20 points per game last night. But that New York stretch was god-awful. Oh, my gosh. Eight points, eight points. He went with his brother in Chicago. He scored 16 points. Previously, he had a, he went to Miami. I guess Miami had 11 points. Then he went 13, 19, and a goose egg. Zero points against Indiana, 11 points against New York, and seven points against Denver. If you look at it, Lonzo Ball also took the most shots he took all season with 15 shots last night. So, you know, Lonzo Ball is the fourth option, obviously. And he's only taking about 11 shots per game. So we, we get it, but Lonzo Ball can be a consistent 20 point per score if he had that mixed bag that he had last night. Lonzo Ball had a conglomerate and, and his game was more so an amalgamation and a mixture of you know the inside and the outside. We know that historically speaking, Lonzo Ball's high point percentages, outages are a result of the three point shot. You know, Lonzo Ball only technically has about, you know, two 30 point games and they're a result of him shooting the three ball pretty, really well, right? But last night was like Zoe got to the line. Zoe had some mid range. Zoe was aggressive at the three. Zoe was giving the Denver Nuggets just a mixed bag of what he could potentially be. And what we need Zoe Lonzo Ball to be right now is that 20 point per score. We need to see Lonzo Ball attacking the rim. We need to see Lonzo Ball changing speed. We need to see Lonzo Ball using feet and footwork. We need to see Lonzo Ball understanding angles. We need to see some heads. We need some pump face. We need to see a more aggressive Lonzo Ball. Lonzo Ball, in my personal opinion, from my royal perspective, can really, really be that 20-point per score if he actually has a three-tier game, that inside, that mid-range, and that three-point shot. That's when we see Lonzo Ball become that player that we know Lonzo Ball can be. And the Bulls so desperately need it right now because they have Cleveland Cavaliers, DeMar, who are just giants, and then they also have 